This is the Gaumont British News, presenting the world to the world. The tennis championship started in a blaze of sunshine, Fred Perry opening the day with his match against the Canadian Rainville. It wasn't very surprising that the title holder had an easy task in this first round, winning comfortably by 6-1, 6-1, 6-3. The next match brought Barotra and his famous Berry face to face with Henkel. Barotra also won as expected. This may be the veteran champion's last Wimbledon, but if so, the centre court next year will be less picturesque, for Barotra is a bounding figure of amazing popularity. The Emir Saud of Arabia was present when Crawford of Australia, with his curiously shaped racket, met the Frenchman Brugnon. Crawford won his match comfortably, 6-3, 6-1, 6-4. The first day of the ladies' matches saw Mrs. Helen Wills Moody opposed by Mademoiselle Baumgarten of Hungary. Mrs. Moody made no mistakes in her 6-love, six 6-1 six victory. But this odd summer of ours produced a violent storm in the middle of the heat wave. The patent covering was soon out over the centre court as the rain came down in torrents. Luckily the downpour ceased in time for the matches to be continued. Miss Dorothy Round, the woman's title holder, played left-handed Miss McCospridge. The champion had a big surprise waiting for her in the first set when her opponent ran her to 8-6, but Miss Round won her second set comfortably for the match. 